Hey, welcome to another video. Today I wanted to make a short video about an exercise which I can highly recommend. Very likely you might not be doing this exercise at the moment, so I hope at the end of this video you might be doing it. As you can see in the background, I have hang up my gymnastic rings because this exercise is performed on gymnastic rings. And once you still don't have a pair of rings, I would recommend you to get one of these because in my opinion it's just the best equipment you can get out there and with gymnastic rings you can basically train your whole upper body and besides that they are very cheap and once you buy them they will last forever and you don't need to buy them again these are not just like unnecessary supplements that you need to buy again and again and again and which don't really help you but this will help you for sure and personally I would say that this is probably one of the best investments I ever did in my life now let's come to the exercise the exercise is called ring turnout hold i'm pretty sure you have already seen people performing this exercise but in my opinion it's still not talked about enough and i think it's still really underrated until this day i include this exercise into my workouts now let's demonstrate me you this exercise so once you have set up your rings you just go here and you just jump up and you just hold you just hold like this and once you get comfortable holding it like this all you do is trying to lock out your arms and make sure everything is stretched try to keep it as controlled as possible and it's best to engage your core and basically all your muscles which are involved in this exercise this exercise might be looking easy but especially for beginners this exercise might be really difficult so that's why I would recommend for people who never touched a pair of rings to keep it easy and don't ever rush the progress and if you are a beginner you will probably not be be able to stretch out your arms completely in the beginning but this will come by time so that's why it's just best to just start holding it as you can and over time once you get more control of it you, you can try to lock out your arms so I'll try to show it to you again you basically just jump up and you just hold it as controlled as you can and once you get comfortable holding it like this it's just best to try to lock out your arms and to move your arms around and just hold it like this as long as you can I'm a big fan of the static movement and even till now before I start my workouts I do one to two sets of this exercise and I try to hold it just like for 10 to 20 seconds and I'm pretty sure that this exercise will drastically reduce the risk to get injured and I guess that's the reason where I never felt serious pain in my elbows or my joints and I never really got injured and I would highly recommend to do this exercise for people who get quite easily injured or who feel joint pain or elbow pain or something similar to do this exercise before you start with your workout because I'm sure this will drastically reduce the risk to get injured and it will just help you to build stronger tendons stronger joints in general and like I said if you are a beginner keep it easy and don't ever rush your progress and take your time because by time you will be doing this exercise in perfection and yeah just take it easy and in order not to waste your time anymore I will come to an end now and I wish you all the best and stay progressive <laughs>